It's been a while. It certainly has been a while. So, why did I go away? Well, the main reason being burnout. That and I wasn't exactly seeing the return on this little hobby of mine that I was expecting. Well, certainly not at the pace that I wanted it to wanted it to um come. I guess I expected a little too much and I just I was just too impatient and I wanted to be on the same level with a bunch of YouTubers that I look up to instantly. But success and fame does not work that way. You gotta work for it. But now that I am back, there are going to be some changes. No, nothing super drastic, but changes that will hopefully make my channel grow a lot better than it did last time, and changes to help me avoid burning out, burning out again. Not saying it won't happen again, but so, some of these decisions I hope will at least make it less likely. Okay, so I think my problem was I've got just a one-man team right here. You know, it's it's just me. I I record everything, I perform everything, I edit, I upload, that, that's all me, and it's not hard, but it's time-consuming. So, because I'm a one-man show, at least for now, I think it would be easier on myself to not do weekly uploads like I used to, but perhaps do them every other week. Gives me more time to uh, relax a bit. You know, I can um, give me more time to work on videos, and uh, I, I I think I won't be quite as under as much pressure as I did when I was uploading every week. Cause it, yeah, I had my job and this to worry about, and. It, it, it just it was just too much at once but I think doing it this way I'll definitely make things a little bit easier on myself and for right now this is just a hobby I don't quite have a big enough fan base or viewership to turn this into my full-time job but with a little effort and a lot of support from you guys we can change that also, to I'm going to branch out and do more than just reviews. I will still do them, but with the YouTube algorithm being the things that, that they are, and um, I'm not uh, still 100% sure on how to all the all the logistical stuff dealing with uh, marketing myself and um, getting support and sponsors. I think the best thing for me to do would be to try different kinds of videos and not just lump myself into one group. Because I think that kind of puts a bit of a limit on my viewership, but if I do different things, maybe the algorithm will notice and lump me in with other other uh, similar review er, videos, other similar videos. I've thought about doing reaction videos, unboxing videos. When I figure out how, I might even uh, I may even start up a secondary Let's Play channel. But you know, let's let's play it by ear for now. You know, trying to tackle too much at once is what caused me to put this on hold last time. And whew, what a hold it was! But let me tell you, it was it was a hold it was a hold that was necessary and. Part of the reason why I came back is recently I saw a comment on one of my videos saying that somebody actually misses my reviews. And honestly, I never thought of that it would happen. I never thought I had a big enough fan base where somebody would actually miss my content. But lo and behold, sure enough it did. And well, here we are. 
Thank you to whoever posted that comment. Uh, whoever posted that comment, you um, you have no idea how big of a boost to the to that to my self esteem that was. So I uh, I think that's all I need to say for now. Um, look forward to more content from this channel coming soon. And because I technically have to now, if you like what you see, then like, comment, and subscribe. Anyways, I'm Ninja Greg, and you've been watching the Ninja Greg Show.